Hi, we're working on grade three, module four, area, uh, square centimeters and square inches input page. It should look like this. Okay, let's look at our sentences. Area is measured in blank miles, feet, meters, inches, or centimeters. It's measured in square miles, square feet, square meters, square inches, or square centimeters. So it's measured in squares, not a long line, a square. Okay, any length measurement can be used to measure area. Okay, so you can have square feet, you can have square inches, you can have square miles, um, any of those can be used to measure area. Square blank are smaller than square blank. Square centimeters. There were a lot of things that could go in there, but our page title is centimeter, square centimeters and square inches, so that's what we're going to put in here. Square centimeters are smaller than square inches. That's because centimeters are smaller than inches. Okay, so this bigger square is a square inch, and this square is a square centimeter. So you can see that a square inch is actually a bit bigger than a square centimeter. Okay, now we have some models where we're going to find the area. So I have eight boxes here, so that's eight square inches, or I could write it four times two equals eight, because remember we can find area either by counting boxes or by multiplying. Now over here I have eight boxes again, but I have eight square centimeters, 4 times 2 equals 8. And you can see that even though they're both 8s, the square centimeters are much smaller than the square inches. Let's look at our final sentences. It is important to show if a measurement is square inches or square centimeters because square inches are blank than square centimeters. Well, square inches are bigger. Okay, square inches are bigger than square centimeters. You can write area as square inches or inches squared or in squared. So those are three different ways that you can show that it's area, that it's square inches. You can write area as, and we're going to write in the word square centimeters or centimeters with a, to the power of two or cm squared. And I will show you what it should look like. Okay, so those are all the different ways to write it when you're working with area. It's time to tackle that output page. I'll see you next time.